Bobby. Hello and welcome to another Yam Yam Drinks Reviews. Um, thought I'd just do a little bit of a guide for the the blade kegs and the blade machine. Um, on the forums, on Facebook and everything, there's always people with loads of questions. So I thought I'd just do a little video. Um, I know a lot of you people that are experts probably know a lot more than me. But yeah, I thought I'd do from the box straight away to there to pour into all that. Yes, but an actual pour into one because I'll leave to get down. But on the box, when you get your beer, again, set up on the blade. So here is my little review. So, first things first, you've got your blade, you can't see it from there, can you? I will move the video around in a minute. So, so you've got your blade over here, all set up. You've got it turned on. You've got the, the wire underneath, firmly pushed up. There's a little button on the side. You've got that turned on, okay? I'll show it all in a minute when I move the camera around. But then, rah, this turns off. So, what's the first thing you should do when this turns up. Number one, mowing. So you're mowing about, oh, it's late, they turned up yet. Number two, if you've ordered this in March, right, let's have a quick look. You're gonna be expecting a gold ticket in here. So, get your paperwork. It's out. There's one, out. Next one. And when you look in here, you're going to find the gold ticket. Right? Fucking yodel. So, the next step then, Moan, fucking yodel, nick the golden ticket. It looks like it had been opened when it come, you know. Racked off there. So, see, it might be stuck to one of the boxes. No, no. This one, alright, we're that one in today. We're going to be going for the Gosser. Gosser Marzen. Okay, so this is your blade kick. I'll put the Gosser in. Actually, I'm going to go for the Oinekin. Yeah, we'll stick the fucking Heineken on first. We'll stick the Heineken in first. How are you all doing anyway? You okay? That's good. So, there's your box, it'll come. And there you keg inside. First thing, stick your finger in there. Pull that up. Turn it. See that little flap? Okay, and then pull it again. There's your your eight litre keg. What you want to do is just give it a check over. Shift that. Just get the check over to make sure it's not damaged. And what you want to do, there's little holes here and here, and this um, grey plastic cover is to line up perfectly those little holes. When you put it in and it don't start going boo, it's probably because of that. They're not lined up properly, so it won't pressurise properly. So if you have put it in and those are not lined up, whip it out, just have a quick look. A good sharp twist on that, you'll get it back in line. Then you want to check that your line's okay. Sometimes they come and that bit's broke, um, you can change it. A bit fiddly, but let's just leave that there for one second. And what we're going to do, we're going to have a quick look at the blade and then come back to the keg and we'll show you how to fit it in. So, I'll see you over there. And we're back, um, got the blade in front of us. So, one of the first things you want to do is your dome, that's provided it's turned up. And take your dome off. And you put it on your head, and pretend you're uh, on that astronaut. 
Okay, so you put that to one side. Uh, you've got your mines plugged in, which mines underneath the bar. And then there's a little button on the side that you want to do. Flip that on, that powers your system up. Little lights. You want to pull this down. And that's theoretically then set up. Set up for your blade keg. You want to make sure you've got two little padlock pictures there. One's closed, one's unlocked. Make sure it's up for unlocked. Okay, now. Keg. So then, the Heineken keg. Um, there's different ways you can put it. They're quite heavy, you know what I mean? So, what you want to do is get a good grip, making sure you get your, your tubes at the front. But what you want to do is one handed, lift it, yeah, making sure that's at the front, and you want to just drop it in, and it'll sit in like that. You know, just that's at the front, and then you pull that through, and you just clip it in, it's that easy. So that's, that's how, that's how you load a keg. Do you mean you don't believe me? It's an empty. Do you mean it's empty? We'll do it, in, we'll do it with the full end. There ain't no way you're putting it in one handed, is there really? I don't know. Okay, we're having nothing, can we do that? Okay, this is, you know, this is the one there. So, best way to do it, hold, this is the best way that I've found to do it, should I say. Uh, you might have your own techniques. If you need to it, you, you know, try different ways. I'll hold the, the pipe there with my thumb, and you can get two angles to lift. Making sure that pipe's at the front, not being caught. And that's in. See how easy that was? And then pull the pipe through the rubber. Little red cap. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh no, hold on, hold on. I can hear, I can all hear you screaming at the, uh, at the video. So. First thing you want to do, orange button, okay? Don't get in front of yourselves. Orange button, firmly push that in to where the, the click. Yeah. And then, turn that sorry, down. Again, hold the line with your thumb, two hands, lift, and then it'll just slot in, give it a little wiggle to make sure it's in. Pull that through, and then you get to this bit, a little red cap, off, and then click it in. So the orange part's in the orange bit, and the black part's obviously the point. Fold that over, and then your lock button there, you've got your, you're on unlock at the moment. Switch that down to lock, and it'll do its stuff. The fridge kicks in, the air compressor kicks in, it tells you you've got a full keg, and it tells me that I ain't pre-chilled my beer. So I just haven't had time. Next, put your lid on. There you go, if you want. Click the lights on, and you can stand here watching that for a few hours until it gets cold. Or you can, I don't know, and paint the shed. I don't know what you want to do. It's up to you. But yeah, anyway, that is the blade keg. How to, um, how to load a keg. So I hope you've all enjoyed it. If you have, like, subscribe, drop us a comment. I don't know, whatever. Um, yeah, see you all. Cheers.